Hey guys, I just got back, or no, I just got to my studio. <sighs> I'm stuffed. I had a really good brunch with my friend Myra. She made me this shirt for my birthday. Custom. And this is actually backwards, but because it's like mirrored, you can actually see what it says. But this is like by far one of my favorite pieces of clothing now. And I don't think I'll ever get rid of it. Especially because it was put with so much thought. So thank you, Myra. But we went to Daiso and I have like a little mini Daiso haul. For some reason at Michael's, they don't have hard pencil cases. So I got one of these. So I can put my new pastel chalk pencils. Oh, how cute, it has a little button. Plain and it's like glitter. So I'm gonna put these in there. Let's do that. Oh shit, I think they're too long. I forgot. Ah, oh, perfect. Hold on. They literally barely just fit. So good purchase. <laughs> so yeah, we went to our favorite um, spot, had some brunch. Had some tea. I'm back in the tea game now because I haven't had coffee in like two weeks. I miss it. I like genuinely love the taste of coffee, but I can't do it anymore. So I'm having tea. Lately it's been mint tea. I do like chamomile and I do like rose tea. Um, that's pretty much it. I haven't really gone into like the super fancier ones like like Earl Grey, English breakfast tea, black tea, and then the ones that have like all those blends. I don't know. Maybe I'll like slowly dive into them. But okay, so there's that. The outfit, and I can even put my other pencils in here. I don't know why, I don't like to have stuff in fabric bags because I feel like I have to like dig. Oh, a little sharpener fits in there too. So that's that. And then I got these pouches for the stationery that I'm going to print out today that launches today. So go feel free to check that out. I'll have links below. And I bought this little A5 notebook. Every time I start a new collection, I buy a new one. And this is where all like my notes, my inspiration, pictures, all that will go in here. So this is collection three, baby November. I should be done with it. And then I follow this artist on YouTube and she has one of these and it just looks really fun. It's to cut out circles. Um, I don't know when I'll use it, but I feel like, why not? And I bought Benny a dog toy. Oh, it only has one squeak. And a piggy pouch <laughs> to keep my change because I usually just throw my change in my bag. And I'm trying to start carrying cash more. So, coin pouch. So yeah, that's my mini Daiso haul. Um, I have to write back my friend. I have to fix my website. I have to launch the stationery. And yeah, so what I'm gonna do first is I'm gonna um, upload a video that I finished editing yesterday and then I'm gonna work on my website and then I'm gonna launch the stationery. So let's get to it. Okay, but can we talk about my new website for a little bit? Uh, I love it. So I finally launched my stationery, it's now live. And I wanted to kind of like redo the website to kind of just give it a refresher so I can announce the stationery, if that makes sense. Anywho, so here it is, and I also launched this emotional letter set that I had been working on. I think this one is like the one I had been working on the most. 
I think it took me like about a month to finally like decide how I want it laid out and how I want it to look. But let's see. And here are my stickers that I'm so happy about. These are so cute. I love them so much. And then let's see. And these are all my recipe cards that I shared with you guys. This is the whole food um, photo shoot that I did. So, but yeah, this is the first of my stationery. I'm really excited. I hope people like it too, and we'll see how it goes. The stationery is launched. I don't know what to feel. I'm nervous. I hope people like it. <sighs> But anywho, I'm waiting for <laughs> vlog five to be up. Um, yeah, I'm so like excited and stuff that I even forgot what the hell else I'm supposed to do. But I'll remember. I will remember. And yeah, that's pretty much it for today. It's kind of like a soft Friday. And then I need to update my other Instagram for the actual stationery where like I post my art. Oh, maybe that's what I'll do. I'll just post a bunch of my art from my sketchbook that I haven't posted too. But yeah, that's pretty much it for today. It's gonna be a short one, I'm sure. Um, I don't know, I gotta configure my Cricut and my printer so I can get that going if I get an order. So we'll see. We'll see about that. But yeah. Okay, so I'm kind of like tripping out because I scanned this with my new printer. Wow. <laughs> this scans really well. Like really, really well. I don't even think I had it on the highest DPI or whatever that thing is. I'm just still kind of like, yeah, it's like, even like, everything. That's insane. Also, I forgot to mention, these are the pants I got back from the seamstress. I'm so happy with the cut. Now keep in mind, they were like complete like bell bottom. Well, not bell bottom, but just super wide legged. And I literally just pinned them like half-assed and I was like, I just need you to taper them. And I love it. Perfect ankle fit and everything. And I've been getting a lot of compliments on my shirt. My friend Myra put this shirt together for me. It is literally my favorite thing now. And like, she didn't even measure me. She just like eyeballed it. And the cut is so cool. yeah it has this patch right here this is i'm just trying to live my life which is facts this is my sign on this little skull here and then it says i just want you to be nice to me and i love colored shirts i have quite a few so this is definitely a favorite of my collection so yeah and then I got back the other brown pants and another shirt, but I'll just try those on when I wear them. I don't know when I'm gonna wear them because it's gonna be really hot for pants. Today was okay, but yeah, I'll wear them when I wear them.